Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. In this video, we are going to discuss about statistical data and the different types of data. If you are curious and uh, you want to learn more about the content that we are creating, then please hit the subscribe button and join us on our YouTube channel. So let's get into the topic. So what is data or uh, statistical data? Statistical data refers to a set of data that is collected and organized in such a way that it can be analyzed and used to draw conclusions or make predictions or decisions. So data is collected to analyze and draw conclusions or predictions based on the data. Statistical data is typically collected through surveys, experiments or uh, observation and it is used to describe the characteristics of a group or a population. Statistical data can be uh, broadly classified into qualitative data and quantitative data and this can further be classified into four types. Uh, they are nominal data, ordinal data, discrete data and the continuous data. So here is the overview of uh, classification of uh, different types of data that is the qualitative data and the quantitative data that is further divided into nominal data, ordinal data, discrete data and the continuous data. So what is qualitative data? Qualitative or categorical data is a type of data that describes the characteristics of a group or a population. Unlike the uh, quantitative data, the quantitative data means that is a numerical in nature whereas uh, qualitative data is non-numerical and it describes the characteristics of a particular group or a population in words or in categories. So here it is a non-numeric classified into words or categories. The qualitative or categorical data that cannot be measured or counted in the form of numbers. That's why it is known as the categorical data. Uh, for example, uh, the surveying uh, which identify the gender as male or female, uh, favorite holiday destination, opinion on something like agree, disagree or neutral etc. Th these are the examples of uh, qualitative data. So qualitative data can be further classified into two types. One is the nominal data and the ordinal data. The nominal data is a type of data that is used to classify or categorize items into groups or categories. And this data is often non-numerical and cannot be ordered or ranked in any meaningful way. And these data don't have any meaningful order and their values are distributed into distinct categories. The examples uh, of uh, nominal data includes the color of hair, marital status, nationality, etc. And coming to the ordinal data, ordinal data is a type of uh, data that is used to rank or order items into specific sequence. Unlike the nominal data which cannot be ranked or ordered in any meaningful way, ordinal data can be arranged into specific order or sequence. And uh, these data are used for uh, observation like uh, customer satisfaction, happiness, etc. But uh, we can't do any arithmetical uh, tasks on them. The ordinal data is qualitative data for which their values have some kind of a relative position. And these data, these kind of data can be considered in between qualitative and quantitative. So these are not truly qualitative but in between qualitative and quantitative because it gives some uh, order or sequence. And the examples uh, include uh, the letter grades in the exam like A, B, C, D, a classification of different grades, uh, ranking of people in a competition like first, second, third, etc. And the economic status like uh, high, medium and low. Coming to the quantitative data, quantitative data is a type of data that is numerical in nature. Uh, making it countable and can be used for uh, statistical data analysis. This data can be represented on a wide variety of graphs, charts such as uh, bar graphs, histograms, scatter plots, box plots, etc. And the examples of uh, quantitative data includes uh, height or weight or uh, weight of a person, room temperature, uh, scores and marks, etc. So the quantitative data is the numerical data and uh, this can be further classified into two types. One is the discrete data and one is the, uh, the other one is the uh, continuous data. Discrete data is a type of data that can only uh, take on certain values and these values are uh, often separate and distinct from one another. And these discrete data are uh, countable and have finite values and their subdivisions are not possible. This data represents mainly by bar graph, number line or frequency table. The examples of uh, discrete data includes the number of employees in a company, total number of players who participated in a competition, uh, number of days in a week, etc. These are some of the examples of uh, discrete data. Coming to the continuous data, continuous data is a type of data that can uh, take on any value within a range and uh, these value can be expressed as decimal numbers or fractions. The continuous data represents the information uh, that can be divided into smaller levels. Uh, the examples include a height of a person, Wi-Fi frequency, market share price, etc. So this is the uh, overall uh, different types of data and uh, the di main difference between discrete data and uh, continuous data is that uh, discrete data can form only a whole number 
whereas continuous data can take up uh, decimal numbers. So in summary, uh, there are two types of uh, data broadly that is uh, qualitative data and quantitative data and this is further classified into nominal data, ordinal data, discrete data and continuous data. So these are the different types of uh, data that is used in the analysis uh, through statistical methods and these are collected through observations, experiments, surveys, etc. Hope you are clear with this topic. If you like the video, please press the like button and share it with your friends. Thank you.